Today inside the cloud, we got some more news with Hip Hop Cloud TV. But first make sure you follow us on all our social media at Hip Hop Cloud TV and visit our website at hiphopcloud.tv. Now let's get to today's news, Rallo respond to the allegation of him snitching to get out of prison faster. The artist signed by Gucci Mane to 1017 been the topic of discussion the past few days but not for the best reason. He was arrested back in April 2018, the feds showed up to a private airport in Georgia where he got caught with more than a million dollars worth of weed and other drugs. It came out this week that some people close to the rapper found court documents about him and his case, stating that he denied multiple drug charges saying it wasn't him but the drugs of his co-defendant. Following the claim one of his friend arrange a call with Rallo to have the situation cleared off has of what happened and why the documents state that he co-operated with the police. The call was taped on video and shared through social media for everyone to hear the story from the man himself. In that video you can hear a man ask Rallo why his lawyer filed a motion to suppress the information and documents stating that he told the court the drugs wasn't his. Not only that, he's also asked why did he put the drugs on his co-defendant. Rallo didn't sugarcoat anything and said what it was. Here is the audio of the phone call. It's, it's in black and white, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm reading your lawyer pleading on your behalf trying to get this record sealed because of this information that you gave. It's, you saying that you never said that you didn't do it, but... You had me believing for five years that you kept it solid, dog. And in and, and, and the paperwork, it say that in two months, y'all y'all got locked up in April. In June, June 6th, you gave a profit. And you gave up information. You gave them folk the code to your phone and let them review it in your presence. That would the paperwork say. Yeah. I, 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 I ain't opposed to that shit. Long the, the, the documents that you're seeing is from a prosecution misconduct. But Hearing. okay, but so if you saying that you gave them just the phone information because you knew nothing was in the phone, what about this shit on page twelve, line twelve and thirteen, where it say he is cooperating against heroin, methamphetamine, he knows about shootings and the marijuana, where it say he is cooperating against heroin, methamphetamine. Okay, I, I, I'm not, I'm not opposition to that. I, listen, when they, when you go in there, they ask you other questions. I, I, I made my they uh you know the code though i this that's what i'm saying you know the code you ain't pulled ahead no meeting uh, with them folks in the fur play uh, uh, queen, it, it's, i mean uh, i was presented a, 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 a situation and that you know that that other i just you can go on i just only reason why you know about this is because of the prosecution that's going to hearing all these rap niggas pay that money to get out of there uh, but I, we ain't the rap niggas though. That what I, that what I. Listen, 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 please, uh, please consider this. I, only, I got caught with this shit on the plane, shake. What the fuck you thought I was gonna do? Take your lick. Like I, shit, I, I, it's just I, I, a week. I, I, well, okay, okay. Look, listen. I, remember when I, before you got locked up, I used to always tell you, "Hey, ah, don't do this. Hey, ah, don't do that. Hey, ah." I agree with you. Following the video surfacing, Rallo posted a picture on his Instagram with a caption speaking about the situation. He stated, even the brothers you pray with will be praying on your downfall, but I clearly can spend my money on what the F I want to spend my money on, it's my money. I'll spend my last dime to get out if I had to. I know plenty people willing take a bag right now to take these charges and pimp the feds. At least they going for a bankroll unlike the rest, they going to jail for free. They would have got out rich. You gotta learn to play chess not checkers with them people. They've been manipulating us for too long at least I had the balls to manipulate them unlike the rest of these real rat ass ninja. He also took to the comment section and answered to fans clearing up the situation even more. One of the comment left read, gotta pay to play, Rallo replied with, they buy pussy and I buy my niggas loopholes out of jail. I think I tried to do better. Another comment stated, what the dude you so called paid off gotta say about this, he responded, he saying these dudes police is hell for even putting it out there. That could have got him messed up. Rallo standing strong on the fact that he didn't snitch. He claimed him and his co-defendant made a deal that he was going to take the extra drug charges other than the cannabis charges. Reading in between the lines it sounds like he offered that co-defendant some monetary compensation for taking those in order to let Rallo get out of federal prison faster. Although what he did is not considered like snitching the internet saying that he should have stayed solid no matter what. Referring to him finding a way and loophole to be able to be released early. We'll have to wait and see how everything play out. It's still unsure if the feds will take those statement and turn around to charge Rallo and co-defendant for lying in court. We'll have to wait and see how this case rolls out. 
We appreciate everyone watching and interacting with us on our social media at Hip Hop Cloud TV and through our website hiphopcloud.tv. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel in order to be the first one to get all the news from the cloud. We out.